this one for us, so let's see. Go for it. It's filming. Alright. What's up, you guys? Welcome to Wine. Jets just enjoy the stuff. My name is Max, and I like to drink wine. Max, aka Max Merlot, today filming on the iPhone 4S. Want to try something different and want to see how it looks. So today, I'm drinking a bottle of extra dry Andre. How's that look? Great. Extra dry Andre, a little bit of sparkling wine. And I saw this trick on the internet. This could end good or this could end bad. Where they shot the cork or the top screw fixture. I don't know if this one will work because it's not a cork. Um, off the chef, or a sparkling wine bottle or champagne. So I'm going to try it here and see what happens. So what you have to do is locate the uh, seam of the glass where the, where the glass kind of came together um, at the neck. So I believe I've located that here. And where that hits the top of the bottle is the weakest part of the bottle. And you slide your knife or your object or whatever up to the top and hit it in a quick motion and it should just pop off with the glass. So let's see what's going on here. <laughs> this could end good or could end bad. Maybe bad. <laughs> 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 this is <gonna> bad. <laughs> <laughs> so let's just drink it. Twist it open. Oh. Ready? You like. Oh, that's not gonna work. It's not freaking. Wow. <laughs> Let's see what's going on here. So, evidently you can't shoot off a screw top bottle of Andre. <laughs> so, nice looking wine here. Nice beads, look at those bubbles coming up. Really light color. This sparkling wine from California. Andre Baby, you ever have the cold duck, the purple grape looking one? Try it out, let's see what's going on in the sniffer. Ah, shout out to Brad Snaza. This one's a little bit biscuity. A little bit of that fresh, crisp apple. Nice little hint of lemon as well. But the biscuit really shows through, and I like that. It's just kind of this bready biscuit. It's like you walked into a bakery, but you're drinking sparkling wine instead. Let's see what's going on in the palate. Crisp, fresh, nice minerality. The lemon and the pear really shows through on the palate. As well as like this, um, this kind of green character, let me try it again. I do like the fresh minerality. Um, and the crisp, it's like crisp green apple, if that gives you a little bit of perspective. The wine is okay. I got this wine at 7-Eleven. I think it was like six bucks or something like that. But it was okay. If you're looking to drink, I might splash a little OJ in this, make a little mimosa. Shout out to my friends at Western. It was the first place I ever had a mimosa. Lonnie Farley. Lonnie Farley. I love you. Um, and yeah, this wine's okay. Andre, extra dry. What's going on today? Winejets.com. Just enjoy the stuff. Today's question is... What is your favorite coffee? Yeah. <laughs> so what is your favorite coffee? JD's happens to be... Dirty Chai. <laughs> Dirty Chai at the student little coffee shop there. And mine is just, my favorite coffee is champagne. Sparkling wine. Winejets.com, just enjoy the stuff and thank you for watching.